God is beautiful. I wasn't going to bring him up. Then I saw the painting. I said, come on up because maybe he'll give it to me. Wow. Come on up. That's okay. Kamala's radical ideas belong in a San Francisco commune filled with far-left freaks, but they do not belong in the White House. They do not belong in the United States of America. This November, Georgia is going to tell Kamala that we will not let her turn America into a communist country. Remember, for years, she has pushed legislation to strip police officers of any protection. They have no protection. Anything they do, they get sued, they go bankrupt, they lose their house, they lose their family, they lose their pension. They ruin their lives. They want to ruin their lives. She was the worst at ruining police officers. When I'm, and by the way, I have the endorsement of virtually every police organization in the United States. Almost every and when I'm president of the United States again, we will never defund the police. We will only overfund. We're going to overfund the police if we have to. I will always give our law enforcement heroes the protection, resources, and respect that they so dearly deserve. And the DA of San Francisco, Harris, shielded illegal alien crack dealers from deportation. She wouldn't let them be deported. She fought like hell. She wouldn't arrest criminals of the worst kind. She wouldn't arrest murderers. She wouldn't arrest anybody. The state has gone to hell. Gavin Newsom is the worst, one of the worst guys. Gavin Newsom. But she was the one that started it. She ruined San Francisco, ruined California. As California Attorney General, she defined and redefined. And during the left-wing riots of 2020, you saw that, she urged her followers to donate to bail rapists and murderers out of jail while saying that the violent mobs should not stop. They should not stop. She said she was endorsing to fund the place and the police. And she said, violent mobs, let the violent mobs keep going. Let them keep going. We love what they're doing. We love what they represent. This is the lunatic that the fake news is trying to build up to be the next Margaret Thatcher. You know, 